you. Uh, do you think the accession to the Gulf Cooperation Council will affect democratic transition in Jordan? I think it does personally. I think uh, although there, there might be some uh, economic benefits whereby uh, markets will be open to uh, Jordanian uh, 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 professionals especially, I think uh, Jordanian industry first of all will be affected because most of the industries in the Gulf countries, especially Saudi Arabia, are subsidized and therefore they will be more competitive in our markets. That's on the economic level and I think on the uh, political uh, rights-based uh, approach in Jordan, I think we will, uh, we will suffer from that. آخر سؤال حقراو إذا كان حد من السبيكرز عنده إجابة سريعة قبل الثورة كان هناك فئات وكيانات مضطهدة ومنسية ذوي الاحتياجات الخاصة عقب قيام الثورة قاموا بالمشاركة معهم وشاركوا في المظاهرات حتى إسقاط النظام حينما استقرت الأوضاع نسبيا وجدوا أنفسهم مثل الماضي لا أحد يسأل عنهم ولا أحد يستجيب لمطالبهم السؤال كيف نستطيع الحصول على حقوقنا من خلال التشريعات وكيف نستطيع إصال صوتنا للمسؤولين ائتلاف ثم مصر Would anybody have an experience of how not to forget the disabled groups who participated actively in the revolution? I think the question is that the, the const, uh, well, the transition process, first and foremost, transitions are never easy, and they're not tidy, they're not linear, it's messy. Having said that, I would assume the revolution is not over, the transition is not complete, and there's a need to ensure that there's voice, and the voice of the excluded, excluded and those who've been marginalized is heard all the time. And I think it's the responsibility and years leaders sitting around this, on this panel, to ensure that those voices are heard, that as the rights are being entrenched in the Constitution and in future laws, that this is taken into account. I want to remind you that UNDP is hosting a reception from 7 to 9 at Almaz Hall, fourth floor at the Marriott. And at the end, I would like to thank very much all our eminent speakers, and I thank everybody who participated, and thank you for uh, your patience.